So I'm gonna name my deck something. When when I make my decks, I like to name them something that doesn't make it obvious, like armor only or something. So I'm just gonna go for like uh, pleb rush. <laughs> I'm not gonna put any bonuses on it. Okay. So are you in it? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so we'll start with the logistics first, I guess, then, yeah? Logistics it is, yeah. Yeah, okay, so I normally always go for my AVGP Grizzly CP command vehicle, you know, the Canadian thing? It looks oh, yeah, kind of like yeah, a striker. Yeah, yeah. You get four of them, so... And it's got two... I didn't realize this as well. It's quick, quicker than any of the... Well, no, is it... it's not really quicker than any of the other... No, it is, no, it is. It's quicker than the others, and it's got the same uh, frontal armor as, uh, as most command vehicles. That's pretty cool. So yeah, definitely get that in. Yeah, I'll get that chucked in. And okay. now, um, oh, uh, FOB. Always got to put an FOB in. It doesn't really matter which one yeah. it is. Yeah, and for this, I just like to put the German one in just because I like the German flag. Okay. <laughs> um, I like the way that FOB shows up in the the, the hangar and it just like kind of spreads out everywhere. Yeah, it's awesome. Yeah, yeah. I like okay. these things. Well. Yeah. yeah. Come on. Uh, Supply vehicles. I used to, most of my decks used to go for the M35 cargo until I looked at the fuel capacity recently and found out it's only 500, which works out at like mm. two missiles for the Hawk, which is ridiculous. Uh, ridiculous. ridiculous. Yeah, yeah. So, what I was looking at yesterday was the Chinook that the Canadians get. Yeah. You use air, you don't use trucks. Well, I normally use trucks, but I was looking at the Chinook the Canadians get, even though you can see right through it, which is pretty bad. You get six of them, and they've got a 2,000 litre capacity, which mm -hmm. is bigger than the British one. And you but get If you more notice, um, the Germans, there's a Jupiter truck that carries a fuel capacity of 1,250, and you get 12 of them. That's the one I usually go for. The MD Jupiter, 12. Hmm. That's pretty compared good. To the, compared to the rest of them, I mean, I know you get 20, but... Uh, well, if I'm, I cap, I did a I'm tempted. I'm tempted. What, what's it, what does it carry? 1,250. And if you go for the one above, the Man Catty 6x6, six by, uh, six by six, uh, you get 1,500. And you get 8. Uh, and you get 8, yes. That's I'm basically like a Chinook on the way. Yeah, I'm it? still tempted for the Canadian ch uh, Chinook looking thing. It comes with 2,000 litre capacity, you get 6 of them. Which one's a Canadian Chinook? Um, the one with the Canadian flag, CH147. Well, if you look at that compared to the uh, Super Chinook, the Super Chinook's quicker by 30 kilometers. So yeah, but you, you only get well just... you only get four, and it's the same fuel capacity. That's what oh, I, yes, yes, that's yes, what yes. I was oh, worried I about. Yeah, yeah, okay. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and chuck the Canadian stuff in for now. Okay. And okay. if I've got spare points, or if I maybe play around and find out, because th don't forget, this also has a large. Uh, I think these have a larger radius of um, of supply. You know, like a truck will have a specific. Like the circle mm -hmm. around it, this has a much bigger yeah. one as far as I'm aware. Okay, infantry. Okay, yeah. Now you mentioned something about some uber German soldiers that that's, have like a that's million accuracy. Recon. Don't worry about that. For okay, now. Recon, cool. that's we'll we worry about it later. Yeah. Okay. Um, so lately I've been going for uber expensive infantry. Yeah, I need to go cheap, cheap. Cheap? No. Not cheap, cheap. I used to go cheap carriers though. I used to go reservists, uh, and that came in the VAB T20-13, but they just get owned. They come with like what looks like some kind of semi-automatic rifle from World War II. Ah, I'll tell you who I've been using lately. Um, mm. It's the French Rima. Rima. If you look at their statistics, they have 9 accuracy, which is, uh, uh, I think, probably the, it's the best I've seen, apart from the reservists. Oh, they look, got 10. Look at, the, look at the accuracy on the, the, the uh, rocket, which is what I normally go yeah, for. Exactly, 12 yeah, and 16. 12, yeah. So, I mean, I've been putting them in with um, uh, one of the VAB variants. I've, I've been changing between the 50 cal and the uh, 20 mil. I'm going to go for the one with the 20. You get 16 of those, so that's decent. How many are you building of those? Mm. Say again? How many do you put in of those? Just one unit? Um, Just one, yeah. I'll have to vary it up between the nations. I'm going to have a look at the Americans. I like no, I like the riflemen, yeah. I tell you what, I have been seeing the light riflemen have been quite good um, at taking out tanks. Okay, I've noticed. And I, in this, yeah, the infantry the infantry is much worse in this than it has been in. Uh, oh yeah, yeah, especially in the trees. Sucks, right? yeah. yeah. I hope they put it back to the way it used to be. 
I don't like the two-man units. I understand what they've done with that, but it sucks. Mm. I might go with the um, either the light rifleman or uh, I can't remember what it was again. Um, I want to go expensive. I want to get riflemen in like Bradleys. I can't find them. No, I mean they're really expensive to call them, and they Brad wouldn't really, you know, the Bradley fires a tow missile, but I mean it's okay. It's just the, the price of it. Yeah. No, I might leave it actually. I don't know. I, f I don't really like the parachutes because they carry a submachine gun. I mean, that pisses me off them massively. Submachine gun. I mean, they got the cargo stuff, but. And they do wear nice berets, but. <laughs> berets, what is with you and berets? <laughs> I love fucking berets, they're brilliant. Oh, yes. <laughs> um, okay. Panzer gun deers. You guys, what I'm gonna they're go for? Too, American bro. rifleman in the M113A1 Dragon. Because okay. then you get the wee dragon launcher. I know it's not the best thing in the world. It's seven they accuracy. Come with that. They come with the uh, the, the poor M72, uh, you know, oh. whatever it is. Yeah, I just noticed that. I've actually accuracy not noticed that. for AP power. Of, yeah, no. American troops. Yeah, they Plum can go. Stay clear. They can go away. Crap, even, the, about, even the French reservists have better accuracy than that. That's shit. What about the uh, Stormers? The, uh, I used I used to use the Norwegian Stormers. Um, a machine gun puts a lot of rounds out. Yeah, it's MG3, dude. It's awesome. No, no. Yeah, I think I'm gonna. No, oh, you don't get many of them, do you? I like numbers. Yeah, N NM135 on the personnel camera. That yeah. Is a, oh. That's awesome. That, that, that is a lot. I'm very fire, That is. Um, <laughs> I don't know what I was gonna say then. <laughs> but you only gonna get twelve of them. It's, it's yeah. Cool. No, I'm not gonna go for them, dude. I'm looking at the um. I know I said I wouldn't want to try to keep away from cheap stuff, but look at that, the the reservists, the French reservists, they've got 6 accuracy, 12 AP power. You get 32 of them, and they come in the VAB T2013 that comes with a Wait, 20 more on it. The French reservists? Yeah. It costs 25 to call in, you get 32 of them, or 24 trained. And, yeah, uh, yeah they come with like some kind of like rifle bolt action thing. I don't think it's a bolt action, I think it's a semi-automatic, but um... Mm -hmm. I'm gonna put those back in my deck just as like something, you know, to fill up gaps. Yeah, no. Yeah. Actually, I'm gonna probably, how many uh, of these do you get? Look at that, dude! For 20 reservists, First you get 32, but they come in an AMX 10P, which has a 20mm auto cannon on it. It's got two frontal armor and one everywhere else. They might be my cheap infantry then, but they're probably gonna get swamped. Well, yeah, they're but it's got range, a 20 but... mil, dude. Oh yeah, well, like, that ain't like 10p, I don't really get, like, rated it too much. Uh, yeah, but, but it's better I than might... nothing. <laughs> I may put them in just for my cheap infantry. They got, they, they got, to, you know. yeah, they, they'd be great for holding towns, because they've got great accuracy with their rifle. Yeah. Look at that, 10 accuracy. That's gonna be really oh. good. And 6 and 12 isn't mm -hmm. that bad for the rocket. The problem is they lack range, because they don't have a light machine gun. Yeah, but I mean, that's where the AMX 10P comes in. If you keep that close with them, like normally when I attack a town, I'll put that AMX 10P in okay, them with yeah, the yeah. town. Let's, let's go with that. I'm going to go with that. Then I'm going to put it there. I'm not going to go rookie. I'm going to go train. Instead. You're going to go train. Ooh, la da aren't you fancy? Yeah, they, they need to be somewhat. They need to be able to shoot their weapons instead. Uh, right. <laughs> shoot in the general go direction. With, I'm going to go with uh, one helicopter troop. Uh, of Royal Marines as well in a Linux AH1 because I need not you know, the Linux, larger maps. not the Linux, whatever. Uh, same links, whatever. Okay, the links um, in the AH1. Yeah, the so yeah, it doesn't. Know, why don't you just go for the one that comes with the missiles, the rockets? Uh, just look, look at the price differences. If I need to deploy them in nothing like you know infantry on the ground, uh, I need you know. Numbers but you only get and, uh, twelve of them. Is there nothing we get more of somewhere else? Good point, actually. I don't, they don't really have any standout stats. I oh, just did my uh, name. That's the only reason I want them. But, <laughs> um, US Marines and Chinook no. US Marines. Yeah. 12. 12 the biggest number I can find so far. I've seen the white riflemen have got, uh, you know, trained 20 in Blackhawks. Um, There's 16 in Blackhawks. Light riflemen, you can get 16. Yeah, I want infantry killers. They don't really, uh, they, don't, they don't really kill infantry that well. They come with an M240, dude. Yeah, but trust me, I've, I've used them last game and I didn't really, uh, well, whenever I played them, I didn't really like them. Rifleman 20, they come with an M60, 20 and a Blackhawk, or 20 and a Huey. Don't you think that's pretty good? Uh, well, I mean, I, I noticed Crap they did tank, and I didn't, didn't really, yeah, no, their AT is good. Oh, that's wow, look at that, point. reservists. I think you can get 32 in helicopters. Uh, and yeah, the helicopter comes with a 20 <laughs> millimeter. Dude, the helicopter has a 20 mil on the side. Yeah. Look at the Jaegers. 
I'm tempted yeah. with that. The re the French reservists in the Puma. Mm -hmm. You get 20. I mean, 32. Hold on. 20, 32, I 32. guess. 32. And then we could just build another type of cheap infantry. I don't know, dude. That's a Swedish. lot. Oh my god, the Swedish carry belt action markers as well. But yeah. Although the one the French carry, I think, is like a semi automatic or something. The Mass 49, I don't know. I'm tempted by the reservists in the helicopter, Jace. They're only 30 mm -hmm. to call in. Go with them then, yeah, go with them. What? I'm gonna, get the, I'm gonna go with them. Yeah, yeah, definitely well, go with them if you want. I don't know, yeah, I'm trying to decide on mine. Okay, I'm gonna put those in and then see if I can find another cheap infantry unit. It's just because if I want something that's gonna come in a helicopter, I want, I want, I want numbers. Yeah, yeah. The Jaegers might be an interesting choice. <clears throat> 15 to call in in a chopper, and you get 20 of them. Jaegers. 16. Jaegers. That was top. Mm. They cost 15 to call in. That's not bad. Okay, yeah, That's so I'm going to put those in trained. Uh, oh, they got yeah. good accuracy with the gun. I'm going to put those in trained, take out the reservists, and put them back, the reservists back in the AMX 10P. Okay. If I can find AMX them. Oh, I want. <clears throat> I might get. Do I want AA? Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna get AA infantry and AT infantry. Yeah, I always go. Oh, I don't know about AT, but I always go AA infantry. What AA? AA what AA, AA infantry? Usually, um, I usually go sting or javelin. The RBS set. Well, what's the stinger and javelin range? An accuracy. Uh, find one I'll and then. I'll tell you the stingers. Stinger is. Stinger range is uh, 2,275 meters with an accuracy of 11. Okay, so I'm going for those then. What ones right. are you going for? What ones are you putting in? Uh, I'm trying to think of the one I was thinking about yesterday. It's down the bottom. Um, I think it's one of the uh, Norwegians. I can't remember what they are. Hang on. The Norwegians use the RBS 60, dude. Or 70. Oh, that was it, yeah. Oh, yeah, it's got... It's yeah, got it's less accuracy. I just think it's the best. One. What about the Javelin? Where's the Javelin at? Uh, Polsky uses the Javelin. Ooh. Traveler's not too bad. It doesn't have as much accuracy though. Okay, now go accuracy. You want accuracy of anything else. So, let's find something that's got these stingers. I want... Uh, the Americans. Yeah, I just want... want to... Think of something else. I'm gonna get him in the Dragon, I think, as well. In the Dragon, yeah. You get... Eight? Mm -hmm. Eight in the Dragon? Eight. Yeah. How many did you get of the... Uh... Eight. Okay, mm -hmm. so we got one more infantry slot before it starts costing us mucho monies. Okay. So, I'm thinking, dude, Jaeger and the yeah. TPZ Fuchs, look at that, the Jaeger and the TPZ Fuchs, you get 20 of them, they've got 10 accuracy, 14 AP power on their anti-tank gun, they've got a machine gun, and they come in a TPZ Fuchs, which got Milan on it, it's got 7 accuracy and 16 AP power. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I think I'm going to go for that. Okay. 20 of them, sorted. Because I'd rather have, I'd rather have that yeah. than a, an anti-tank infantry, because if you look... They got 10 accuracy, 14 AP. Watch the anti tank uh, infantry got. Look at that. The, the anti tank infantry, 7 accuracy, 16 AP. So the, the Jaegers are actually more accurate than. Um, wait, that's Jag Commander. Yeah, no, that is AT. Uh, anti tank infantry. Yeah, so they the Jaegers are more accurate than the designated anti tank infantry. Okay, yeah, good point there. Yeah. Um, so they might be worth um... putting a second one in. I don't know. No, that's good for now. I'm gonna move on to support now, dude. Okay, yeah, go on. Let's go. Okay, support. First of all, anti-aircraft. Let's it's see. Aircraft, yeah. The Hawk. We don't get the American Hawk because we are not playing as Americans, so just put the normal Hawk in. You get six of them. Okay. Well, yeah, Denmark yeah. one or... Yeah, yeah, Danish one. I'm gonna put two yeah. groups of that in. Cause, like, okay, you're gonna get two of them, yeah? Yeah, it's the best, it's the best we get. They only come with three missile... Mm, yeah, Dude, it's three good missiles, long range, accurate, blah, 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 blah. Okay, right. Okay. Artillery? I never oh, even used you, this so you're stuff. Getting, you're going through two groups, are you? Yeah, six. Uh, okay. Yeah. Okay, right, cool. I'm gonna go with the Chaparral, anyways. You got, why are you going for the Chaparral? You get four missiles, uh... And I just, I think it's a nice variant if they get seed aircraft, they won't be able to take it out because it's infrared. Good spot. I'm going to put that in. Yeah, otherwise you'll okay. just get destroyed. Okay, I'm not going to, I don't think I'm going to put a mortar in. I mean, uh, artillery in. I never really use the stuff. 
Okay. Well, okay. You use any artillery these days? Well, I use occasional the occasional mortar, but I just never bother pulling it in. It's such a pain in the ass logistically. I've got much bigger problems to deal with. English have got a nice uh, artillery piece. Oh, what that big crazy looking thing. Jesus Christ. We have eight rounds a minute. Fires 155mm round. Yeah, the HE bicam. Yeah, I might go with that. Is that you only get one of them though? Yeah, no, I wouldn't go for something that you get one of. Mm. Most of these are... Mm, French things, not looking too bad. I don't know. I might discover mortar, the American mortars, just for some close support if I need to. Mortar. Actually, no, I, I thought, I don't know, I need something that's going to crush enemy morale. CRUSH ENEMY MORALE! <laughs> yeah, I know. Um, Look at that, the yeah. M10RA. Oh, one round a minute. 203 yeah. millimeter, though. That, that, one round a minute. Oh, my goodness. You know what we forgot for the um, AA, by the way? What about the rapiers? Oh, no, they suck. They suck. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. Tracked rapiers suck. Alright, okay, so what's your RTP you're gonna go with? Um. I think I'm just gonna go for some mortars, dude. Yeah, okay. or, or are you going yeah. for an artillery piece? I'm going for a small, medium artillery piece. I'm gonna go with the Abbot. The Abbot? Hold on. Okay, you get three of them. Uh, it's a British one. It's not got the greatest range, but I'm gonna be basically using it as a mortar, anyways. But uh, behind the lines. Um. Well, quite far behind the lines. Got a good yeah, good I'll drop in power, a bit. Suppression. Hold on a minute, yeah. Tell me the HE power and the suppression, please. Just so I can... 242 suppression, HE power 8. And how many you get? 3? What's, 3, yeah. What's the, what's the range? 16,800. Dude, I'm looking at the American M109A2. It's 23,800 range, 10 HE power, 357 suppression. You get 2 of them, and they're hardened. Uh, which one? The M109? M109... A2. A2, okay. That's it's pretty chunky looking. Cost the rate of fire though is a bit of a letdown. Is it? Okay, let's go for the Abbott. I've seen you guys using those a few times. They seem good. Okay. You gotta chuck okay, those so in. Are we happy with that then? Yeah, yeah. we don't really need anything else. No. Yep. Yeah. Tanks. Yeah, we can come back anyways. Yeah, yeah we can come back. We well, what we can do is we can try our deck out and if it doesn't work, we can change it. Tanks. Yes, okay. I'm always, always gonna put the good old M1 A1 Abrams in from now on. Yeah, I just realised that the AMX30 B2 Brennus has an axiom of 12. Yeah, and it, an AP yeah, power of 16. It's, it's a beast. Okay, oh, so I'm going with that then. <laughs> you're putting that in. I'm putting that in. If you've got an axiom of 12, that is that's beautiful. 11 frontal armor though. That's. It's not that, well, I'm not gonna. I mean, I'll be hitting people on the flanks with it. Then I won't be attacking head on with things. Okay. Well, I'm going to put the M1A1 Abrams in. Eight of them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then I'm going to put two lots of the cheapo M1 Abrams in. Because that, that gives me 32 of those. Um, yeah. What else? So, what about... Um, oh, I yeah. Need, I need a light tank, really. I like the AMX-13 Harpon for a light tank. It's guns pretty crap, but it's got rockets on it, and you get tw uh, 16 of them. Look at that thing. Okay. See? Yeah, I usually go with the Sheridan. And look at its but... rate of fire on its gun. 19 rounds a minute. Let's have a look. 19 yeah, rounds a minute. You're going to just pump down the lead. If you don't kill the thing, you're going to stun it. I'm pretty mm. sure from playing World of Tanks, that thing's got an autoloader. So I'm going to chuck that in. Okay. Okay. You got any other things you're gonna put in? I'm just having a look here. I mean, I like the chieftain, uh, the chieftain line because of the uh, it's got good frontal armor and it's quite cheap to call in. Don't get many it's of got, them though. You get twelve uh, chieftains if you get them trained, but um, yeah. Like I would rather get the the M1 Abrams. It's got better frontal armor, and you get more of them. You get sixteen of them, dude. Yeah, I might get this, uh... The Abrams has a more accurate gun, too. I think. Mm. Yeah, I'm gonna go with the AMX-13, I think. With you, same with you. Try it out. Hop on, yeah. So I'm kind of, yeah. I'm kind of lacking in tank department then, really. <laughs> I haven't really got the... Okay, well, we can come back to that if we want to reinforce that. Chuck, chuck a bunch of cheap uh, ch uh, Abrams in, dude. Oh, yep. I've got two Abrams and an AMX-30 B, uh, B2... Okay, cool. Okay, yeah, so reconnaissance. 
Right, this is where it gets juicy. Yeah, right, juicy, basically, juicy. the infantry that I was looking at, if you have a look at the, uh, see, what I had was three different infantry squads, uh, all with their own special, like, um, you know, uh, you know, like, outstanding stat. Yeah. If you look at the, uh, Fern Spar, I can't pronounce it. Fern Spar, yeah. Oh, yep. Um, if you look at them, they got 12 Axie with their G3s, and they got a sniper rifle. Yeah, that's the, that's the guys I use. Yeah, they are just incredible. I, I, I burn them in, in the Milan, usually. Oh, you use them on the ground, okay. Yeah, oh, you're using them in the air. Well, you have to yeah. you have to dismount them anyway. Either way, I'll probably use them in the Milan now. Yeah. Well, the, I, I would what rather have the Milan. Like, yeah. What? Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Yeah, go with that. I'm going to go with the Milan veteran. I'm putting eight of those in. Yeah. Um, Can we get the... Uh, well, what else do you see here that's... Normally, I use the easy? SAS. Um, I don't really use them anymore. Do you know I've what? I've looked at their stats. I mean, they've got... They're just basically bog standard infantry with... Crap AT, oh. awful AA. Well, all the Brits kind of have crap AT, kind of sucks. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Um, so I don't really use them now. I usually use Rangers for some reason. With the Rangers. Um, their accuracy is, uh, they have outstanding accuracy. Um, Rangers. Okay. Look. In what? And usually I have them in the air, typically in Blackhawks. See, I'm trying to stay away from the air because that's a weak point. You know? Well, I like to fast also, move, guys, but, um, yeah. Yeah, also, mm, yeah, you can fast move in that bloody Humvee. That thing's pretty nippy, dude. 150? 100, that doesn't, oh god, it goes 150, yes. I'm going there, there with that, then. <laughs> okay, okay eight of those. That. Yeah, no, it's... And then I looked at the, um, there's a sniper team. Oh, uh, dude, special. Rover Pinky. We have to put oh, Rover right. Pinkies oh, in. Rover Pinky is the uh, recon vehicle. Yeah, yeah, and that's definitely. all the recon I'm going to put in, because you don't want to have too much recon. We've already got, what, 16 okay. and 4 is, yeah. Yeah, I, t I don't know why I tend I've been using recon lately as, like, my uh, infantry. Uh, no, no, dude, it's stupid. Guys. Stop, be stupid. I <laughs> know, oh, but, um, okay. yeah, obviously I have one recon. But anyway, yeah. let's move on to the vehicles. vehicle. I was looking at the Jaguar. I don't know, you'll remember this was absolutely atrocious in the last game. The Jaguar 2. Yeah. It's awesome now. <laughs> At least it's sure? that's awesome. At least it's that's awesome. Well, we can what's, what's, what, what does it compare with the Ito? Okay. The okay, you get the Ito up. I'll um, read okay. the Jaguar. Okay, so okay. range. Uh, well, first of all, it carries 12 missiles. Yep, same I think, more. Okay. The range is 2625. Yep, same Accuracy more. 12. Yep. AP 22. Yep. Suppression 150. Mm hmm. And rate of fire is 6. Oh, ours is minus 10. Yeah, but I don't, I don't know if, so the Ito, will... is it better? Yeah. I, uh, it can't really defend itself, because it, well, the Jaguar but can. The Ito itself, only has, the Ito only has eight missiles, dude. No, the Ito's got 12. Oh, you're talking about the ITW, not the Ito. For now, is the Ito. No, the Ito's the one below it, called the Ito. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, my bad. <laughs> yeah. Oh, but... wow, that's got 30 rounds a minute. Yeah, but you don't want quick. You want it to fly and then kill the thing. Because if you fire two before the missile gets there or something like that. Remember, I like the Jaguar just because it's got the machine gun on it. Okay, well, either way, it doesn't really matter. Um, it's quicker, just, too. Just choose whatever. Just I'm going for the... How many of the Itos do you get? Six, six. Itos. <laughs> I'm going to go for six Itos instead of four Jaguars. Done. Okay. Might go with the Humvee tow, I don't really know yet. Dude, you only get four of them. Yeah, I know, exactly. Just go for more ITOs if you can. I mean, the... this is a this is a nice little one. Um, the Swedish have a PVRB V551. PVR PVRB. Only eight missiles. Yeah, be eight of them, and they come with uh, good accuracy. Um, oh, you do get eight. An ITO. Uh, and it's got a, uh, you know, a light machine gun. Yeah, I'm, silver, I'm putting, I'm that. putting in two of those. Okay. Because after reading that guy's post who commented on my video, thanks for that post. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, <laughs> I realized I need more AT and stuff. Yourself, yeah. Because yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go with napalm tank as well. Napalm, uh, Mark, a flamethrower yeah, tank. A flamethrower tank, yeah. Why? Infantry suck in trees now. No, I, I like them. Well, what, I the M60 the you're going for? Yeah, yeah. You get 12 of them. Yeah, I'll put them in. Why not? Okay, Keep let's go split. a helicopter. Mm -hmm. Now, okay. every time, without a doubt, um, the AH-1F Cobra. Which one's that? Okay, you go with that one, do you? That's yeah. interesting. Why do you, what do you go with? Oh, I usually go with things with Hellfires. 
Yeah, but that's got that the toe on it. Anyway. It's yeah, pretty... but the Hellfire's fine. I forget, so you can just move out of the way if you don't. Where's so the usually... Where's the Hellfire? <laughs> Usually I go over Seahawk because it fires. It only fires four, but usually you can kill three or four tanks of it in quick succession. Yeah, but it's, yeah. it's only got missiles on it. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. What it's to do six. is look. We've got three points, so what I'm gonna do is chuck one of the Seahawks that you said, yeah, yep. and then I'm gonna chuck the two of the other Cobras, because then you've got two, the best yeah. of all world. Because the other Cobra, okay. it's got great accuracy. It's got rockets and a gun in case you need it. Okay, yeah, cool. I'm gonna probably actually go with um, uh, what's it called? The Stinger aircraft as well. Oh no, I'm not gonna go for. Okay, well I, I like. To Dude, look at that sometimes. little thing. The thing the Danish get the tow defender. That thing looks G. <laughs> <laughs> it's got four. Well, I don't know. Yeah, it looks alright. Looks like it's got a little jet. Probably shit, but you know. Well, yeah, 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 yeah. But <laughs> it looks pretty beastly. What's the Anyways. what's the one you going for there? Um, I went with the RH58. Is it the Kiowa? Oh, the Kiowa. I think it's Kiowa. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's pretty cool looking. You get four of them. Yeah, they're good if you got like annoying helicopters near you and you need to shoot them. Yeah, I'm. Like, I'm gonna chuck that in, and then if I don't have enough space for the planes, I want, I'll remove it. Exactly, okay. Onto the planes. Right. Okay. First thing I'm gonna okay. put in for my planes is gonna have to be because I'm always gonna be playing with you with this deck. This is the playing with uh -huh. Jason deck. I'm gonna put the Tomcat in. Yeah. Tomcat, you're gonna have the Tomcat, the F-14, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And then on top of that, I'm gonna put my old favorite F-16A. I'm gonna put oh, yes. two groups of those bombs. in. Two groups, so that means you get four. They uh, drop cluster bombs, don't they? No, I think it's just a dumb bomb. Mark 82. I don't like cluster bombs. So, you know cluster bombs are designed to take out, like, you know, they have AP power. Yeah, I know, but take, I, think, yeah. I prefer the dumb bombs. You get 12 of them, dude. They're big enough. And it comes with aim nines, so it's multi-roll. Okay. okay. Yeah, so, okay, I've got three activation points left. How much? I could put another Tomcat in or a Raven. Why don't you go Ravens? I'll go Tomcats. That's what I usually do. I usually go A-10s, two Ravens, um, and then something else. Okay, so I'll go the Tomcats then. I'm going to put in another Tomcat, and that's me filled my deck. I'm uh, happy with what it is. The Dude, stay for. away from the Aardvark, honestly. Why? Because I, I used it and it's not very good. I've seen that thing destroy tank lines. Mm. Okay, well, whatever. We, I've, we've got a good... Okay, so I'm happy with what I've got in my deck now, dude. Yeah, I am pretty happy as well. Uh, I, I've got everything covered. Yeah, okay, I'm well, happy okay, well, with that. That will do for that. Okay, so a quick overview of what me and Jason have just put in our decks. Well, we roughly got the same decks. We've got the AVG... Uh, FVGP Grizzly Command Vehicle, it's the Canadian one. One FOB. I've got the Canadian version of the Chinook for logistics. Infantry, we've got the Reamers, Jaegers, some reservists for our cheap infantry just to fill gaps. LAD Stinger A Infantry, Jaeger, Milans. They're pretty good. They've got better accuracy than most of the anti-tank infantry, so it's good to have those in. So support, Jace, you went a bit... No, we went the same with support, didn't we? Yeah, we did, yeah. Yeah, so we got two group, well, a group of the Hawks, a group of the Shafts, so one radar guided, one non radar guided, and the Abbots for artillery. Tanks, I think Jace went different. Yeah, I went the M1A1s and two groups of the M1s, and then one group of AMX 13 hard ponds. What did you go, Jace? Um, I went AMX 30 B2 Brennus, uh, M1 Abrams, M1 A1 Abrams, and AMX 13 Harpoon. Okay, so not too much differentiation. Not too much differentiation. Okay, I think we went the same with the. Recon, we went the Furnish Bear, Rangers, and the Rover Pinky. I love the Rover Pinky. Okay, so for vehicles, I went two groups of the PVRBV551 and one group of the Zippos. Is that what you went, Jace? No, I had the ITO. Oh, you um, went ITO? Okay. Yeah, P oh, the M901 ITW, whatever it is. Okay. Uh, PVRBV551 and the Zippo, yeah. Cool. Okay, helicopters, I think. We kind of went the same, yeah. We got I got Seahawk, two bits of the Cobras, and the OH-50C, the thing that comes with the Stinger missiles. Yep. Okay, and planes. We because we these decks are going to be for playing with each other on the 10v10s. Um, I've gone for two Tomcats and two F-16s. Jace, what you got? Oh, uh, I've got eight two A-10s, uh, two Ravens, and two Aardvarks. Yeah, so that's just a quick overview of our deck and us making the deck. Hope you enjoy it.